Hi. I'm a little out of breath. <laughs> I haven't gone running yet. But this is day two. Fail two. And I say fail because uh, I get a good view here. I hope this works. I don't know what it's going to look like. My, uh, my GoPro decided to completely die. It's been charging. I don't know what happened. It's dead. So I drive all the way over here. This, it looks pretty crap, like a giant mud hole right now. It was beautiful yesterday. It was absolutely beautiful. I'm, I'm highly disappointed. <laughs> um, it was beautiful yesterday. The sun was out. It was just a beautiful sunset. And of course, the audio is crap. And it's probably not going to be super great either because there's an airport. So the planes are going to come flying over pretty soon. I just want to say thank you to all you guys and the support and the love that you guys show me in the last video. I'm holding this up. I'm not even using a, like I had a selfie stick. I got like all this equipment to try to give you guys some of the best stuff and man, I'm, I'm currently recording on the Google Pixel. So hopefully this, this looks good. <laughs> I'm so frustrated. <laughs> I'm so frustrated. Uh, so tomorrow maybe I'll have a better video but I don't know where I'm going to be for that. Um, what I wanted to tell you guys, like what today I'm thankful for, is uh, my grandmother. Now my grandmother passed away on April Fool's Day a few years ago, which is fitting. I think it's very fitting. And she used to take me to this place uh, when I was little, all the time. Here. Over there is uh, right there in the very center is where we went around the corner and there was rain uh, the day before. A huge, like the whole cliff had collapsed. And we were walking over. Here comes a plane. Uh, I'm gonna, <laughs> I'll finish the story in a second. I'm gonna wait till this plane passes. All right, so right over there, it, this cliff had happened. This huge uh, collapse had happened and we found clay that I could actually build out of. And my grandmother was so sweet. She, she has an accent. Um, She's Dutch and she's from Holland and all that stuff. And she just could never say my name 100% correctly. It was always uh, Matthew instead of Matthew. And so it was always, you know, oh, Matthew. It was, it, I, I miss her. I miss her ter terribly. But this was where she always took me here. Uh, the tide is out right now. Usually when it's in, all these little creeks all right in here we're all fill, are all filled in with water. Uh, this is a, a wildlife preserve. And yeah, it's just, usually it's a lot prettier and not so muddy. But what I'm thankful for is my grandmother and um, what she taught me about nature, how to appreciate it, how to enjoy it, uh, all the different little things that make it tick and make it work. She took me camping, I want to say for the first time out in Maine. Uh, I haven't gone since, uh, but that was when I was like 15 or 16. It was amazing. I really do miss her, but she taught me about nature and I really I'm thankful for my grandmother I mean, I'm thankful for what she taught me and I feel like All too soon we forget a Lot of stuff that those that have passed on what they had actually taught us bad or good They might have done some really horrible things, but we knew not to do those things and, um, Yeah, I just uh, really appreciate for that kind of stuff That's uh, that's it so Thanks for watching and I'll catch you guys next time.